let's talk about getting into the alignment of the vibration and the energy of abundance. How do we do that? How do we have abundance around us? Well, the first thing you've got to meditate on abundance in silence, picture that you've got abundance around you, wealth, health, happiness, peace, love, family values, money, or even use your imagination that you've got abundance. Call it, call it out. Use your words. Say, I have abundance. I am abundance. I've got abundance. And feel it. Feel abundantly everywhere you go. Look at all the abundance around you. The trees, the grass, the animals, the colours, the fresh air. Just give gratitude to abundance all around us. It's everywhere is abundance. Try not to get yourself out of the alignment of abundance by your mindset or your actions, especially with your money and how you spend, or we say circulate, not spend, because circulating is abundance. It brings it back to you. But just look what's happened just recently on the Black Friday on the TV. You will see people queuing up hours before the door opens in the shop and the stores. And when the door opens, they're like mad dogs all rushing, try to get in, crambling over each other and pushing each other and fighting each other to get to the quickest bargain and the quickest discount and the cheapest product they can have and fighting and pushing. That is telling your mind that you, do, you don't deserve the best. That is putting you out of alignment of abundance, going for something as a bargain. A bargain is telling your mind you're not worthy of the best. You're not worthy of abundance. It's telling you you're in lack and scarcity and you need something cheap and you need a bargain. So you'll do whatever it takes and fight over it at the uh, discounts on the Black Friday. That is putting yourself out of the alignment. And asking for something for nothing from the universe as well. Expecting something for free. That is also taking you away from abundance and putting your mindset in lack and scarcity. Remember, the universe does not give you anything in this universe for nothing. Everything has a trade. Everything has a duality around it. You've got to put some energy into something. You can't get anything for nothing in the universe. So that would um, send you away from abundance as well. And be careful of buying cheap things, going to a jumble sale. I'm not knocking jumble sales. I think they're good and I think that they can do some good. But if you want to align yourself with abundance, if you go to a jumble sale and get second hand clothes, again, that's lack and scarcity. Telling yourself you're not worthy of luxury goods. Go out and treat yourself to some designer clothes. Pay for the best. Get the best shirt, the, the best jacket, trousers and dress and the best and treat yourself to something luxury and wear a designer clothes. They feel great and they make you feel good and they put you in definitely the frequency of abundance. So be careful and be aware of what you think about bargains, about cheap things and about sales because that's definitely putting you in a 
alignment in scarcity and lack. You're not in alignment of abundance, wealth, health and prosperity around you. You're in the lack of poor and limitations and you're in the lack of feeling you don't deserve it. Of course you deserve it. You have a right. It is your birthright. God, Jesus came to you so you can have life and have it in abundantly. So you deserve it. You deserve to be rich. You deserve the best and the fruits of this earth. And don't ask for anything less. So align yourself in the frequency and the matrix of abundance and see your life change. You'll just be full of abundance around you. Money will come to you. Love will come to you. Peace will come to you. You won't worry about money and lack and scarcity because you will be in that frequency and you're not going to buy into the other low energy of lack and scarcity and poverty. So come into the alignment of abundance and see your life change. You deserve it. You and your family deserve it. And remember, take care of each other. Bye-bye.